In this video, we're going to go over relative and absolute poverty. Relative poverty is having low income in comparison to the rest of society. This is usually defined by a threshold that is a percentage of the median income. So for example, a country can set a threshold of 50% of the median income. This means that anyone who has an income that is less than 50% of the median income is in relative poverty. One thing you should be aware of is that the criteria for relative poverty depends on the state of the economy. So if there is economic growth and the median income increases, then the threshold for relative poverty is going to change accordingly. And that's because if medium income increases, then a threshold like 50% of the medium income also changes. Absolute poverty is not having enough income to afford basic human needs. And basic human needs include food, safe drinking water, shelter, and more. This is defined by the United Nations as a dollar and 90 cents of income per day. So that means individuals that have an income less than a dollar 90 cents per day is considered to be in what is called absolute poverty. Now, you should note here that the criteria for absolute poverty is not affected by changes in the economy. And that's because even if the median income rises with economic growth, the minimum income required to afford basic human needs has not changed. All right, so that is relative and absolute poverty.